Greetings, everyone. I am Lotus Prince, and for this Let's Play, we are going to tackle Resident Evil Dead Aim, the conclusion of the Gun Survivor series. In this game, we play as Bruce McGavin. Remember Bruce McGavin from the Resident Evil games? Sure you do. He was in Namco Cross Capcom, that Jap Japanese-only PlayStation 2 game. Well, you remember Project Cross Zone, right? It's kind of a sequel to that game. A sequel to a game we never got that featured Bruce McGavin from Resident Evil Dead Aim. But as for Dead Aim itself, it's actually a pretty cool title. It looks and plays like a Resident Evil game of any other kind, except that when you aim, you go into first person mode, and you can move around in the first person mode if you so desire. So if you want, then you can play this like the other Gun Survivor games, but it also has the general Resident Evil aesthetic, if you would like that as well. And you have bigger maps. This isn't just walking through pretty basic areas to get to an obligatory boss at the end. Of course, there are the boss fights, but the general exploration feels more like traditional Resident Evil. This game is an effective combination of classic and Gun Survivor gameplay, culminating in a relatively short, but fun and kind of arcadey experience. Let's take a look at where it goes. Let's go crazy. Oh no, no save data. Oh, I did it. I saved it. This game contains scenes of explicit violence and gore. We're back, baby. It's Capcom time. This is the first time Resident Evil has looked this good on the PS2. These graphics are amazing. This is a post-Resident Evil Zero game, so these FMVs look gorgeous. A kingdom where beauty has an absolute authority? What? Resident Evil Dead Age. Oh, whoop, whoop, money for that. Anyway. I don't think there's much to work with, with options. Ah, <sighs> I would like to be able to use the gun con in an HDTV. I actually could use a mouse, which is amazing. I could use a mouse. I can fire with the left button and reload with the right or something like that. But I think I would still have to use it in conjunction with the gun con, because I still need to move around. But that's pretty great. Controller settings, I think I'm good. Yes, yeah, sneak move, I can sidle around a little bit. Fire is R1, reload is R2, and nearly every face button is confirm. Although cancel... What confirm is X and circle? Whoa! And cancel is square and triangle. That's bizarre. I'm kind of used to triangle canceling, but X and circle being confirmed is weird. Also, this game does have 180 turning. If you double tap left, I think it is. Anyway. Um, vibration on, why not? Ooh, just felt it when I turned it on. Movie caption on, please. Thank you. I did not expect this. I guess that's good. I don't think there's anything to do with... Yeah, monitor tuning, meaning get off your ass and tune your TV yourself. Ugh. Screen adjustment, though? I can... Yeah, I can move the screen around, which is kind of cool. Oh, well. Aim adjustment? Adjusting sensitivity? Maybe I just can't do that unless I have the gun con plugged in. I have to... I'm just using a controller, so I guess it's just what it is. All right, let's do a new game. Definitely uneasy. I, I know that it might be less satisfying to watch an easy playthrough, but these Survivor games are pretty rough. I don't know how tough this one's going to be, but... Easy. 
Establishing a kingdom where beauty is absolute authority is the dream, which I must make a reality. And his name is actually freaking Morpheus. Get it? Because he's the great god of dreams. Raccoon City, a midwestern town in the United States, was destroyed in a substance known as the T-Virus. <laughs> Captions are off, but fine. However, Umbrella, the corporation developing the virus, refused to abort the project. These captions aren't even close. The threat of biological terror was thrust upon the world. A large amount of T-Virus was stolen three days ago. A terrorist group hit an Umbrella lab in France. Yesterday, one of Umbrella's cruisers was hijacked and contaminated with the same virus. The text in the FMV and the text in the captions are wildly different. Also, I gotta, gotta admit, I'm disappointed that we didn't get Resident Evil Dead Aim or anything like that. I think that's my main guy, Bruce. Why you American spies choose to use such ugly guns is still a mystery to me. Is that Morpheus? Morpheus. Uh, yep. Just immediately. Ling Fong. <laughs> Jeez, that was a regular grenade. <laughs> that could have killed me. Take that, Morpheus. Oh, he's just still up. That's crazy. Oh, there he goes. Sweet dreams. Haha, <laughs> you see what I did there? I'm clever. Excuse me, double tap? Okay, double tapping down. It's down. I know that down makes more sense, but I swear the manual told me, uh, left. Whatever, down makes more sense anyway. Okay, so left and right move the camera. That's really weird. So I have to move the- so I'm not actually turning my character, I'm turning the camera, but then I can move forward. That's really weird. Oh, this is gonna take some getting used to. At least I automatically run. Can I look at the thing on the floor? No? Also, it's awfully dark. This game kinda just gets right to it, doesn't it? Oh, by the way, you want to see something really crazy? Yeah, there it is. If I hold L1 and use the left stick or the D-pad, I can move while aiming. Take that, Resident Evil 4, you friggin' scrub. Unbelievable. Uh, but I don't know where I am, though. But theoretically, I could play this game in the first person if I really wanted to. What if I go back out and go the other way down the hallway? I see. There's nothing. Okay, fine. I'm sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Back in the room. There we go. I have to hold L1 first, of course. I could go in the open door. 
Ooh, hello. Take the handgun rounds. Four of six. This isn't traditional survivor then. I have limited ammo? Wait a second, I don't know if I like this. It's very dark, I still don't like this. That's a corpse. That's lots of corpses. Jeez. That's a lot of bodies. One oh one. Damn, is it dark? One oh three. One oh four is where I came from, implying this is one oh two. Hey. It's cool how some doors are just open. Oh, hello. Green herb. It's also weird that it's not making the standard item sounds, like the classic Resident Evil item sounds when I pick up objects. This is eerie. I don't think there's anything on the table. Oops. Ugh, I really gotta get used to this. Can I not look down? I'd actually just have to move away. Oh, well, my apologies. That's how you do it, okay. R2, gotta get a little used to that. Ooh, bathroom. No classic scare, I suppose. Okay, I guess there's nothing in here. Wasted a little bit of ammo, though. Sorry. Let's go right back out. Now I suppose I may as well go the other way. 104, 102, this is 103, it seems to be closed. Yeah, no kidding. I think they mean locked, but 101, right? But whoa, whoa, whoa. It's a red cursor, I could shoot it. I can't, it's really creepy that I can't look up. Like, this is as high as I can look? That makes it way creepy. Ugh. That's really eerie. Um, a glowy that's on a body. I feel safe already. Ooh, a map. My best friend. It's still holding something. It... First class key, sounds good to me. That's the body. That's absolutely what that is. Now, can I, like, here's map here, right? I can easily, shotgun, whoa. I had, yeah, I meant to do this. But I'm, oh, that's good. Can I see where I am? Oh, this is this is amazing. Are you kidding me? I didn't expect it to be this good. Let me just try one more thing. Oh my god. Okay, selects takes me straight to the map. This is some good stuff. I can't believe it. But I can, ooh, a little fast. I can move while aiming. Uh, oh. yeah. Wow, I suck. Isn't there, I forgot what I do. Like, I think there's a dodge option. 
but I forgot how exactly that worked. Actually, how's my health? Did I embarrassingly screw this up more than I... No, it still says fine. Thanks, Bruce McGivern. Whoa. <laughs> this is so awkward. But wait, I can quick turn, right? Can't I? Yeah. Damn. That's how you do it. Anything else? Because I think enemies can actually sometimes drop stuff, but guess not. Anyway. That's the first class key. Did it. I'm in. What is it? Oh, uh oh, oh. Huh? No drops, it seems. That's what that was. I guess he didn't notice me. Ugh, th this aim is pretty sensitive. But I want to shot the, the bad guy. Yeah, nobody's dropping anything. Disappointing. It seems to be closed. Fair enough. I appreciate that it blacked out the thing on the map for me. Actually, I love when that happens. It's like Silent Hill. I mean, I guess Resident Evil did it with locked doors. I could go in here, though. Ooh. All right. By the way, is there a way I can see... There's something I wanted to check, and I'm not sure it's going to show me. It just says cruise ship. Okay, the thing I wanted to look up is... Uh, I believe this cruise ship is called the Spencer Rain. So there's, there's your Spencer. And there are the stairs. This is the classic Spencer Mansion stairs. And there's the... Oh! I automatically go up and down stairs. I can't walk down one step. Like in Resident Evil freaking 3. Okay, fine. Yeah, I just have to watch him go down the stairs. But I don't have to press anything to do it. I just walk, which is kind of nice. Right, it looks pretty safe right now, actually. I'll go back up and I'll take a look at that painting. There's always some weird, like, classical painting going on. What is that, Venus? Oops. Not a bunch of people bathing, I guess? Alright. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna work my way toward the VIP room. I suppose I could have gone even the way I originally came in instead of crossing over, but oh well. I am standing right in a zombie. I guess they don't mind. Good. It's very eerie to see just a bunch of enemies waiting to, to appear. Yikes. See a glowy. Right by a sitting corpse. Documents lay scattered on the floor. I didn't even have to press anything, it just shows me. Very convenient. Take the guest key card. Uh you know what? Not yet, because I want the documents. Can I just activate? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Emergency facts from Paris branch. September 18th, 2002, International Sales Division. Attention, Roberto. Today, three T-virus samples have been stolen from this Paris lab. Our prime suspect is Morpheus D. Duval, who belongs to the R&D division of HQ. Yeah, Morpheus is a former umbrella worker. His motivation appears to be based upon retaliation against our company. Therefore, we are sending out this general warning to all divisions. 
Anyone who obtains any information regarding this matter should contact HQ immediately. Regards, Umbrella Corporation, Paris. I really love that the last two games, I think in a row, have apocalyptic potential with enemies who also hate Umbrella. First it was Marcus, now there's this guy Morpheus. I added the documents to my file. Good for me. This is perfect. And the reason I didn't want to pick up the key card is you know it's a key item, literally. I'm gonna spawn like somebody's gonna wake up. Somebody. Now I'll take it. How many are you gonna get up? Uh, whoa, way more than I'd like. I think he dropped something. Damn, I'm good. You know it's gonna get harder later. Herbal medicine? Does that say raccoon something on it? That's hard to see, but that's cute. Also, what's my inventory space looking like? Like, is that just it? I'm full? Life and key item. All right, well, it looks like I have separate inventories, which is actually very cool. I'll take that. Oh, hello. And I can take an herb. And... I guess it doesn't matter. There's either way out. I'm just going to loop around anyway. Wow. Notice he flashed red for a second when he noticed me. It's actually possible to do this without having zombies notice you, which is really cool. Anyway, handgun rounds. I am filling up my inventory, but I could always just reload my stuff if I really need to. Well, at least these guys are dead for sure this time. Whoa, 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 whoa. Actually scary. Oh my god. Th this is a, a problem. Can they navigate stairs, do you think? Let's back it up and hope to god no one comes from behind. There, it looks like they might not be able to navigate stairs, but this is actually intimidating. I think I might be good, though, in terms of safety, but that, this is scary. Again, I have a very sensitive aim with this right stick. It's, it's awkward. If I were using a gun con or a mouse, this might be better, but I'm not, so it's not. Sorry. You gotta admit, though, when I do it right, I do it right. That's pretty damn cool. I don't think anyone's dropping items, unfortunately. My god, I'm a hero! Medicine, I guess. Alright, yeah, let's just clean up this ship. I'm one of those people. I want to be safe. Look at this! Can you even believe this? Ah, Combo stopped. There it is. Didn't drop anything. None of you has dropped anything, unfortunately. Oh well. Although, actually, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, let's just go right back. Now that I've completely wiped this place clean. Freaking excellent. Okay, this place it looks like I already cleared. Is it possible to go in here? Nope. What about that other door? 
I'm not 100% on this one. Maybe I should just look up my own key card. Can I just look up my own key card? It doesn't seem useful. I, can I look at it? It just says it's a guest room key card, but what guest? Or is it room... I guess room 103, right? What else would it be? Oops. I don't like the fact that it's taking so long to load the- yep. This is actually a problem. Good enough. It's so dark I can barely see them. Awesome, awesome. Marble medicine, why the hell not? Okay. Yeah, that went about as well as it's going to, right? Can I enter room 103? No, that wasn't it. Could there possibly be something I want to do on the other side then? No, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. This is what the guest key card is for. Okay, better. Wait, what? Five billion dollars. What? We have until midnight tomorrow. Retrieve the virus from the movies. We already know my name. That makes sense since you're blackmailing both of my friends. <laughs> this awkward slow mo. What's your name? If cooperation is too much to ask for on our first date, then might I suggest we simply stay out of each other's way? These captions are just wrong. For me, that's my name. And I don't dare fresh me. <laughs> what? Do really want to help? Then go help. Dude, I'd love to. <laughs> Fong Wing it had as, as one name, but in the manual it's like first name, last name. <laughs> A cool scene though. But yeah, we're getting blackmailed for five billion dollars. We need the T-Virus, so that's a pickle. All right, does the map change now that I'm on the first floor? Oh, it actually does. Pool deck. Entrance. More guest room. Man, this place is pretty big. <laughs> also, move over Resident Evil Gaiden. This is not fully traditional, but more traditional Resident Evil on a boat. Oh, potted plant. I swear I thought it was a freaking herb. How embarrassing. Oh, hello. And gun. And what's this? The panel controls the electronic lock. There is a key card slot here. Oh, and the guest key card just works. Well, that's easy. 
Hooray! But I guess just for the second floor? All locks on the second floor VIP rooms released. And that clicking through multiple doors reminds me of Resident Evil Remake. And Zero, for that matter. Alright, let's go back up to the second floor, right? Oh, that's awesome. It just circles them. They're unlocked now. Alright. Uh, second class passenger rooms. Alright. Let's go. Can't really see much through that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Behold my genius. Jesus! It's the strongest cop in the world! Alright, anyway. Oh, for God's sake, really? I thought I was done with you. It's a sad day indeed when a headshot isn't quite enough. But alright, I got them. From 201, why not? Handgun. Green herb, why not? Nothing to see here. I, I can never tell what's an item that I'm able to pick up. And I believe there is something else that I want to get here, and I can't find it. Not in the cabinet. Maybe in the bathroom. Whoa! Doesn't help. I can't cheat my way out of that one. A twice-folded document. Regular report number 1162. To HQ International Investigation Department, attention, O'Neill. This will be my final report on Morpheus for a while, since it appears that he is starting to suspect something. Until further notice from me, please refrain from contacting me so that I can devote myself to doing my regular job as his aide. After robbing the lab in Paris, Morpheus appears to be preparing to board the cruiser to auction the items. His obsession with the beauty keeps escalating. So that's what that was in the beginning scene. And just recently, he has undergone plastic surgery to retain his youthful looks. He often says questionable phrases like, I will eliminate the ugly things in the world and create my kingdom filled with beauty. We need to take action against him before it becomes too late, since he's currently in negotiations with several countries, including the United States. P.T. Strange, I could have sworn P.T. was Konami and not Capcom. Clearly I was mistaken. Sorry. Anyway... No kidding. Okay. <laughs> wow. That was free. Alright, let's keep running around. Two oh five and two oh six. Two oh five is no good. I'm not getting a, an anti-opening message. 206, we're good. Oh, hello. Excuse me? A silencer handgun, huh? Damn. Because remember, there's technically stealth in this game. You can have zombies not notice you. So theoretically, I could kill a zombie and have his friend not notice me. This is amazing. Whoa, whoa. Jeez. Nope. <laughs> Actually scared me. It's the first proper scare in this game. 
Would you listen to this music? No way. Handgun rounds, alright, that's my limit. That's a ton of ammo. And there's a typewriter, does it work? Yeah, alright, save. Sure. This is kinda rad. This game does not play quite like the previous survivors. Oh, it didn't type out my save. Oh well, it's fine. This is looking interesting so far, but for now, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We started exploring the Spencer Rain, this cruise ship that our main enemy, Morpheus, who was in the opening cutscene, is in. I guess we gotta grab the T-Virus and get it away from this guy because he's holding the U.S. government kind of ransom, or he's blackmailing him for five billion dollars. I'm gonna go ahead and say no, buddy. I don't know where Morpheus is or where that T-Virus is, but I better find one of them. Until next time, everyone.